So uh, when Jeff gives us the go ahead, all right, thumbs up. All right, guys, we are back. Uh, IFCO TV, we're doing it live from New Beginnings. Uh, this is uh, April 26, 2014. We're with the awesome Jillian Kirsch, director of the Aurora program at Sherman College, very big deal. Uh, she is a 2009 Sherman graduate, and she's also in private practice as well. You do a lot of stuff too. I but... really hate free time. Oh my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> So um, let's get into things. Uh, now it's it's loud back there, but the mice the can mice pick us up perfectly, so no worries about that. Uh, uh, so I know a lot about Roar, mm -hmm. but but there might be some people out there who don't know a lot about Roar. So can we just start things off by saying what Roar is? Yes. And so um, the Roar program is uh, actually an acronym, and it stands for Reach Out and Recruit. So. Um, what it is, is it's about 325. Last year, I looked at our, our broadcast from this, and we had, a, I think, 200, and now we're up to 325. Wow. I've been very busy. That, that is very busy. <laughs> I've seen on Facebook. Yeah. I know. Traveling um, all over the place. So these, all these 300 people that are across the world, I mean, we have Israel, we have Singapore, we have folks everywhere in the States, obviously, wow. Canada. Um, they help Sherman's admissions and recruitment mm -hmm. offices reach out and inspire the next generation of chiropractors, which if we're trying to grow a stronger, more principled profession, it's just, it's amazing the help that these docs are giving us. And you obviously right. are one of them. So Thank we're you. very grateful for you sending so many students mm -hmm. to us. Um, but it, it's really trying to grow the profession and make it stronger is what our goal is. Right, right. And uh, so uh, you said the program is growing. Do you, do you have any goals that you want to achieve? I would like to see a thousand. That's awesome. my that's my, my big one right now. Right, right. Um, last year we doubled in size, mm -hmm. so I'm hoping for I don't I don't think that, that might happen again this year, but I'm hoping right. for something close. Um, but I just want to expand our reach, and that's mm -hmm. why I came back to Sherman. Is I really wanted to impact the profession in a different way. Yeah. And I, just you know, being able to see what's happened the last year, I feel great about what we've been able to accomplish at Sherman, Absolutely. and what all of my friends and colleagues have also been able to do. Yeah. Now I know um, I work with Roar a lot, mm -hmm. and uh, whenever I'm out at a, a festival or a booth, I always have Sherman yeah. stuff swag on yeah. there. And you guys, you send me shirts, you send me brochures, you send me, you, you have a PowerPoint that you sent yeah. to me uh, for when I'm educating the, the, the students because I have a lot of undergrad students with the internship program. And that's how we sort of um, have like a, a gateway to the grad school. So undergrad students learn about chiropractic, then they get into one of our offices and you're teaching them. But if you have something set up like the Roar program does, it makes it so much easier. And uh, can you share with uh, the viewers uh, what else is going on like with the Roar program specifically um, when you're down the term, when you send a student to Lyceum, let's say, right. for the career day, what, what are they going through? So when you send a student to Sherman, what we do is we have, they can come for a personal tour, which is always great. Mm -hmm. Um, but we also have larger events that they can come to. So next week is our Lyceum weekend, which is huge. Um, and we have what's called Career Day at that event, which is a two-day event for students to come. They'll tour the school. They'll talk to current students. They'll, they'll take like mini palpation classes, mini technique classes. They'll listen to these great speakers we have lined up underneath the big top um, and really get a sense for what the spirit of Sherman College right. truly is. Um, and, and we have some Roar members that are actually going to be presenting to them and saying, this nice. is what I do in, in practice, this is what makes me successful, this is why I love what I do, and I, this is why I want you to love what you're, you're deciding to do. Right. So um, we invite these students down, and, and we even have some travel monies available for those students. Um, if they meet certain criteria, which are if they have 60 hours of college credit, if they live more than 200 miles away, and if we've looked at their transcripts and, and they're serious about it, we're willing to help them get down there and see if this is the right place for Right, them. right. I know um, this September we have two or three students starting. They went, uh, one visited last year at Lyceum Time, went through the war program, uh, and one is going down there for this Lyceum. He already applied to Sherman, but he's going to go through the Lyceum uh, this, uh, in a, what is it, next week? Next week. Oh yeah, my gosh. it's pretty awesome, and he's excited. So I told him to uh, track you down today, meet you, uh, uh, greet, become your best friend. Right. Yeah, yeah, because you have the vouchers for them to get there, so that, yeah. that's pretty awesome. Uh, and who is speaking? 
to him. It, uh, I know last year, was it Bryn? Bryn, Bryn actually didn't, but Bryn is this year. Okay. Um, awesome. I, she because I worked for her like yeah, yeah. <laughs> I was like can you please do this for us and she's like oh my gosh I would love to so yeah. I'm very fortunate to have that relationship with her and mm -hmm. and her practice is different because she's in a rural area mm -hmm. she's open adjusting she just loves people and she right. loves serving them so that's why I wanted her to speak um, also Jeremy and Amanda Hess two of our okay. um, yep. Regents and President Circle mm -hmm. members they're also going to speak too awesome awesome yeah. now if someone wanted a, a, a viewer get in touch with you or somebody who's going to hear this in the future wants to get in touch and become part of the ROAR program, how can they contact us? Uh, to become part of the ROAR program, you can go to the Sherman website, www.sherman.edu, and then do forward slash ROAR, R-O-A-R. There'll be a little little page that says sign up. You can fill out your information. An email automatically gets generated to me, and then I'll send you your starter package. Right. Um, if you're a student and you want more information, you can also go to the Sherman website at sherman.edu. On the right side, there's little buttons that'll say visit here, um, apply now, or send me more information. Mm -hmm. Input your information, and we'll send things out to you straight away. Right. Now, how does the, the ROAR program help Sherman College specifically? What I love about the ROAR program is it's people with what I like to call, we all have Sherman pride. We all right. love Sherman College, whether we went to school there, whether or not we just realized that it's the best, you know, we feel as though it's the best school in the country, whatever the case may be, whatever your reason. Um, we all have pride in that school. And to see people, you know, whether or not they donate their time by going to a college fair and trying to get students interested in chiropractic, whether or not they host a, an event at their office and say, you know, this is why I love what I do. Um, the the pride that these people have is just so inspiring, to, even for me. You know, right. I do it every day, but it's yeah, so yeah. awesome when I have people that go out right. and help me. They're, they're even singing songs about Roar. I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> there, no, there, there was a video going around, all an official video, yes. but, it, but it was it was great. Uh, it showed a lot of the members from Roar and uh, put to the Roar song. So yeah. uh, that, that, that was pretty cool. Uh, now, uh, now, what do you do specifically for the, let's say, the chiropractors going out to an event? Mm -hmm. uh, like what do you want them to display? How do you want them to talk with the students? Can you share a little bit about that? I can. Um, so usually I'll send a package about a week or two ahead of the event. Mm -hmm. And I have, you know, kind of like little how-to things that I've created. You know, here's some of the, the admission requirements, which mm -hmm. have changed since we were in school right, drastically. Right. So be familiar with this. Have it with you in case somebody asks a question. You'll be able to answer it straight away. Um, I even include now pictures on how to set up a table. We include, you know, we have these events coming up. Make sure if a student wants to visit, you talk about these events. And I send them all of our recruitment materials from our view books to our student maps to one of my favorite pieces this year was the top 12 reasons to, to choose Sherman College because we couldn't just pick 10 you know right, right. Um, so all of those things I send with them usually I give them a call a day or two if they're they're new to the program hey do you have any questions about any of the material you know some of the talking points you may want to mention are and right. we kind of guide them through the process awesome awesome and now how has uh I've seen you on Facebook going everywhere. Like everywhere, every time I see you, you're updating your status and you're like in a different state. Yeah. Pretty much. Okay, share with some of the people where you went to to help bring Roar. Well, part of my thing is, is especially as a, not necessarily as a recruitment tool, but mm -hmm. I was a prospective student. I was an applicant. I was a student. Mm -hmm. I'm now an alumnus. I'm a practicing doctor. So I, I encompass a lot of different things that right. really bring, um, really bring some strength to what I have to, to present to students. So I do a lot of traveling to pre-chiropractic clubs. Some uh -huh. schools have pre-chiropractic curriculums. Awesome. And I go visit them. And, and my last one at the University of Wisconsin, we did a mini palpation lesson oh, nice. with them. And I just want to bring Sherman College to those students. I love Sherman College. Mm -hmm down to my bones, I tell you, and I just want to share that with students. And there's a lot of people that don't realize, I don't, can't tell you, I didn't even know Sherman existed until you came here. And wow. it, it breaks yep. my heart that that happened, yeah. but at the same time, I'm doing my job correctly. If I'm saying, you know what, we are an option, you know, we mm -hmm. are in South Carolina, we're, what we're about, where we're located, and that's really been a great part of my job for the last year. Right, right. What's one of the most 
uh, more fun places that you went to? One of the more fun. I tell you what was the biggest surprise for me in 2013 was Salt Lake City. Okay. I absolutely loved it. Yeah. And it just so happens, this is a funny story, um, I was out there to go to Brigham Young University. I also went to the University of Utah and a couple other schools while I was there. But my intern, so when I was in first quarter, my intern, Elizabeth Pagano, she was out there running a half marathon. She wants mm -hmm. to run a half marathon in all 50 states. Wow. And she was actually out there the same really? time I was out there. And so it was nice to catch up with her mm -hmm. and her husband, um, Merck Flores. They practice in, in Raleigh, North Carolina. But um, it was so, it was just crazy how we came to, you know, we were both there in Salt Lake City mm -hmm. of all places. Have you had a chance to travel outside the country yet? I did go to Puerto Rico really? last year, oh, yes. Awesome. Dr. Cordero uh, mm -hmm. packed me up in his suitcase and took nice. me down to Puerto Rico. Nice. Oh, so I was able to go down there. But I haven't – That's mm -hmm. I've really been trying to stay, yep, stay well, in the States a little bit. Mm -hmm. um, we got out to Arizona this year already. Okay. Um, last year I was up in Michigan oh, all the way. I did a trip from – South Carolina up to Michigan, down through Kentucky, nice. into Alabama, now, all the way. Now, do you go to the undergrad schools, or are you going to, is that? I'm doing, when I typically do a trip, mm -hmm. I go to undergrad schools right. um, and stop, and usually we'll have an event, and we'll, you know, it's what we call a career night, and mm -hmm. kids will come and learn about Sherman. I'll stop at offices, my Roar offices along right, the right. way, so nice. um, to make sure that they have everything that they need on hand also, mm -hmm. so we try to kind of serve two purposes while yeah. I'm out there. Wow, you're 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 hustling out there. I'm telling I you. Know. You're doing a great I job. I told you, Frank, I hate free time. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so uh, Jillian, uh, let's uh, share with the folks uh, how they can get in touch with you specifically. Okay. Yep. Um, they can email me. My email is jkersh at sherman.edu or you can give me a call in the office. It's 864 five seven eight eight seven seven zero and you'll find me at extension two two zero perfect well jillian thank you so much for stopping by oh, thanks Excellent. for having me uh, listen people the the roar program is very very important not only to sherman college but to the profession the students are going to get a great education at sherman college uh, they're going to learn all the skills uh, adjusting and communication skills to get out there and start taking over the well, world and we have a student roar program mm -hmm. also so i have about 12 students that go out and talk Talk about Sherman and chiropractic wow. across um, if they want to go back to their home state, if they mm -hmm. want to do some things in South Carolina, to really have them understand how to speak chiropractic to somebody who's not in a chiropractic bubble. And right. it's fantastic. I listened to some of them last week. Mm -hmm. They have come so far, and I'm just so proud of them and where they're going to be when they're in the, practice. These students are amazing. I had uh, the opportunity for some of the students uh, from a few different schools. Yeah, oh, that's right. And, uh, Amanda was up. Yeah, and they came up to my office and I'm chit chatting with them, and they're they're like very very well with their communication skills. And then uh, they a couple of them checked my spine and mm -hmm. adjusted my spine, and, and the skills are way up there. So we're graduating some excellent chiropractors Absolutely. for the profession, and we need to keep that going. And we and if you know of any students that are remotely interested there, there's not a better career in my opinion than becoming a chiropractor hey hey peter kevorkian's dancing behind the camera so he, <laughs> thank you peter appreciate that okay uh so uh jillian uh, any last words that you can think of before we head out i can um as long as you can inspire someone to choose chiropractic mm -hmm. it doesn't matter what school they go to as long as they they really help you know, inspire that student, mentor them as they're going through the, the process of becoming a chiropractor. And that way they're graduating with a good understanding of what chiropractic is. That's the most important thing. Right. Yeah, absolutely. I agree. Well, Jillian, it's been a pleasure. Keep on working. You're doing a great job helping the profession grow. And whenever I chit chat with folks and I hear them uh, helping the profession grow, that's my favorite thing uh, in, uh, in the world because we need to share the profession with everyone. Yes. All right, Jillian, thank you so much. Yep, I'll see you on the next, actually next, later on for yeah, lunch. I know, yeah, right. Yeah, yeah, okay. Later on, and I'll introduce you to some of my uh, students who are here at oh, New Beginnings. Yep. Absolutely. Do Thanks. they have tickets for lunch? Uh, they, I do, but I don't think they do yet. Okay. Yeah. All right. So I'm going to have them come talk to me. Great. Excellent. Definitely will. Thanks, right. Jillian. Thank Bye. Okay, guys, that was Jillian Kirsch uh, from Sherman College, the Roar Director. And if you have any questions for her, just uh, hit her up on her email or just give her a phone call. She's uh, very, very wonderful uh, talking uh, to. All right, next.